get by to sing. Oh, 
Thank you all tonight. Uh, we play that the McDowell Mountain Music Festival. It was wonderful. And I told uh, sort of the inspirational story behind this song. <laughs> My next door neighbors, when we was kids, his daddy worked at an electrical supply company in the warehouse. The owner of the business had this little river retreat in Orangedale, Switzerland area down in just below Jacksonville on the St. John's River, but it was nowadays there's houses everywhere there, but back then it was like secluded wilderness. I was sitting in London, England, you know, and thinking about that place, thinking about all the crazy things we used to do back when your parents didn't buy you shorts, ever. You cut your britches off. Crazy shit, fishing for mullet. Throwing cast nets for trying to learn how. Dodging alligators. You cut your arm out there. And the only time ever, ever, we finally decided just to go skinny dip and some girl, strange girl, walks out on a dock. And we're like, uh, all of us, knee deep water, sit down, butt in the water as fast as we can. 12 years old and there. And I used to think, man, shit, you know, I was sitting there thinking about this song like, man, where did that magic go, you know? It didn't go nowhere. I did. I finally figured it out. I took the trip away from the magic. I left it. It didn't leave. I started believing all that shit on the TV, all that shit in the newspaper, all this bullshit how the world is so fucked. And it ain't. <laughs> yeah, no, it ain't. It's always been that bad, man. It ain't no big deal. Bad shit happens, good shit happens, man, but you roll, you know? So I got my mojo back, man. I dodged that bullet. So that's what this song's about now for me.